Alright guys, welcome back to Octavia Networks, it's Johnny here, playing some more The Last of Us Remastered Grounded mod. Now, you all know it um, by now, oh. excuse me, you all know it by now, um, this series is, you know, for the last, because I'm going to be dying like 20 times per episode. It's not for the cutscenes or the scar story, because I've got my other playlist for that. Alright, without any further ado, let's get on with it. Yeah, I know you've already all seen this before if you've watched the first playlist, but it's going to be quite funny when we get like halfway through the excuse me when we get halfway through the game, and there's going to be like tons of enemies and tons of fights and stuff like that, and I'll be dying con constantly because I don't understand the aspect of cover in this game. You know. Excuse me, I'll run up to an armed guard and try and hit him with a wooden plank. Even though I've got like five shotgun ammunition. But anyway. Also, I should point out, there's actually a really violent bit later it's um because it, again if you've already watched this then if you watch my other place then you'll know that we go to meet robert and well he's not the nicest of chaps put it that way and he sends his uh, like private army on you or something and that was quite hard even on hard mode hence the difficulty but on the hardest difficulty in the game it's gonna be even harder <coughs> excuse me again outside the wall or we could just let Robert go <sighs> cute hey Tess you see that shit I was there hey how's the east tunnel looking yeah, it's clear I just used it no patrols and where are you off to Gonna pay Robert a visit? You too? Who else is looking for him? Uh, Marlene? She's been asking around, trying to find him. Marlene? W what do the Fireflies need with Robert? <laughs> you think she'd tell me? Well, what did you tell her? The truth. I got no idea where he's hiding. Good man. Hey, you stay out of trouble, all right? Military's gonna be out in force soon. Yeah, see you around. Marlene looking for Robert? What do you make of that? I don't like it. We better find him before the fireflies do. This is us. Hey guys, how's it going? <sighs> Shit's stirring up out there. How are we looking over here? Uh, it's been quiet. No signs of military were infected. That's what I like to hear. Joel, give me a hand with this. Y'all yeah, take it easy out there. Oh, God, this place reeks. I need to watch them throw away down here. There be light. Grab our gear. Not a lot of ammo. Mm, it's 
shots count. Yeah, as Tess just rightly said then, that's something you have to learn pretty early on. Because, um, unlike games like uh, Call of Duty where enemies like infinitely spawn until you progress past a certain point, it's a bit different right. in... It's a bit different in this game because there is actually a limited amount of ammunition. So what she said, make shots count, she is actually giving us valuable advice. Even if she seemed even if you think she's being a bit cocky. Come on, I don't really want to be in this bit. Come on, let me run. Thank you. Where's the ladder? Gotta be around here somewhere. I know where it is because I've played this game about five or ten times. Five to ten times. Great, bring it over. So I totally know where it is. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake, Joel. Get a grip, man. Thank you. Oh, what? Surely it should be me first because I put the ladder off. Looting for ammo. Even though there's not going to be much of it. So what's the point? Come on. Parts. Nothing. Uh, may as well. Nothing as far as I can see. Here. There was a firefly mark on the wall. I thought there might be a pendant there, but clearly not. For his sake, be better. Once we get our merchandise back, it should be easy to unload. Hold up, spores. Oh, brilliant! Where the hell are all these coming from? The place was clear last time. Coming At least, um. Do you know, actually, no, never mind. I was going to say something, but it doesn't really matter. Better keep your eyes in. Should be able to fit through here. You okay? Yeah. Damn ceiling's falling apart. Be careful. This way. Easy. <coughs> watch it, watch it. I think Tess, I'm gonna take his ammo and just walk off. Come back. Survival of the fittest, mate. Why are you telling me about listen mode because I can't use it, I'm on grounded mode? Why the fuck can't I move? Oh, on this mod it doesn't even give you um heads up displays. What the fuck? Christ, this is even harder than I thought it was. And that is an exaggeration. 
it took about two hits for them to kill me. And I can't see my health bar. Oh my god, this is going to be so difficult. So I've got to guess what my health's at. Oh, this is going to be so fun. Let's head back into the city. <laughs> Should make for an interesting series, though. <laughs> but it does mean you'll be wasting medkits sometimes, because... You'll just be thinking, Hmm, do I need to use one? But then again... Um, you do get like a sort of notification if your health's low. Like, um, I, th I think it's just like some red around the screen. Yeah, combat's really going to be a challenge in this one. Joel, you should go first. You opened it. You're letting a boss you around. I think I just interrupted some of Tessa's dialogue. Because she usually says something like, uh, pass me the plank or something like that. But I've played the game so many times, she doesn't need to. Because I is a boss. That's what I said, Joel. Well, I didn't say it, but I was thinking it. She's being really bossy today. Make sure there ain't any soldiers over here. Claire, come on. I just want to say something. This proves how long cutscenes can be, because. I think this is where I was ending part three on my last series of this game. Right, so I think we're going to leave it here, guys. Um, stay tuned for the next episode, and remember, rate, comment, subscribe.